The Kuwait National Development Plan sets the nation's long-term development priorities. It's organized around seven pillars or areas of focus for investment and improvement. Healthcare. Improve service quality in the public healthcare system and develop national capabilities at a reasonable cost. Under the patronage of His Highness Sheikh Jabir Al Ahmed Al Jabir Al Sabah, Desman Diabetes Institute was established to address the growing epidemic in Kuwait. With his efforts to promote national welfare, the Kuwait Foundation for the Advancement of Sciences surveyed the top diseases affecting the Kuwaiti population. Among those diseases, diabetes was the fastest growing chronic condition. As a result, KFAS financed the establishment of DDI. The foundation's cornerstone was laid on 8th of May 2001. On the 16th of June 2006, the institute was inaugurated by His Highness Sheikh Sabah Al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah. The institute's mission is to prevent, control, and mitigate the impact of diabetes and related conditions in Kuwait through effective programs of research, training, education, and health promotion, and thereby improve the quality of life. DDI is governed by several committees that support the functions of its three divisions, research, medical and operations, and accredited by ACI Canada. DDI also upholds the highest standards to ensure compliance to the policies and procedures, maintain proper conduct within the values of the institute, and follow the ethical laws and regulations. DDI aims to create a platform for diabetes research and education, increase public awareness on diabetes and its comorbidities, reduce the incidence and prevalence of diabetes, encourage a healthy lifestyle. The annual plan 2017-2018 is scheduled to continue 164 projects that will contribute more than 50 billion in revenue. Now we will take you on a social media tour regarding Kuwait development projects. From Kona account, Kuwait announces major development in petrochemical projects. And from Kuwait account, 80 to 90 percent of 48 important development projects solved. And from Kuwait Daily News account, Jahra Road development project at 94 percent completion. And from Kuwait Times, I mean informed of islands development projects, part of vision to turn Kuwait into economic center. For more information or details regarding Kuwait development projects, please visit the websites on the screen. On 14 of June each year, uh, the World Health Organization celebrates the World Blood uh, Donation Day. This year, uh, the theme for 2020 under the slogan, Donate Your Blood and Save the Lives. It is an international event and it is a, a good event that, uh, and a good opportunity to thank all our donors and all our uh, community. Uh, societies who worked with us uh, to have a good supply for all hospitals uh, in Kuwait. The campaign focuses on the participation of individuals and donors to improve the health of others in the local community. The culture for blood donation has been improved in Kuwait and it has been very well uh, seen uh, during uh, this period where we have the coronavirus uh, pandemic in Kuwait. So we saw that the donors are very committed for uh, giving the blood and the other communities are very committed to help us in uh, gaining and recruiting more uh, donors. So this day it is an opportunity to thank them all. WHO has called people for donating blood in conjunction with the outbreak of the coronavirus via social media following the spread of the coronavirus.
Ministry of Public Works spent 14 million Kuwaiti dinars to upgrade the El Bedaz roundabout in a bid to ease traffic flow. The project includes widening of the Blajat and Ta'awun roads on the seaside and a grade level exchange. The project involves a 670 meters long bridge connecting Blajat Street and Ta'awun Street on the Gulf Road, also included as a 70 meter service tunnel. Public authority for roads and transportation seeks through this bridge to reduce the traffic burden on the roundabout and reduce the traffic time of the road from El Town Street to El Blajat Street, especially as this area is densely populated. The person heading to the Arabian Gulf Road across the fifth ring will find ease in traffic during the current period. This is due to the opening of the Northern Bridge, which has already made a move on the previously congested traffic circle in the region. Work was carried out in Al-Bidda's roundabout with an external diameter of 132 meters and an internal diameter of 100 meters, divided into four traffic lanes to facilitate traffic in the area for its vitality and the roundabout will be opened after the end of its work. The three-lane Blajat and Town streets will be converted at the roundabout into a two-lane ground-level road and a two-lane fly over for both the north and southbound lanes to ease uh, congestion. The project includes the construction of a 70-meter service gateway opposite the diplomatic club and fishermen's duania. A large part of this work has been completed which includes cables for electricity and telephone work and surveillance cameras. The work of the project includes the completion of some special lines of sewage and sanitary networks, especially in the street of the Blajat. A sanitary line is being implemented for the treated water in the new routes connecting and connecting with the existing network and then removing the old lines in preparation for the implementation of the network of roads that are parallel to the bridges from the road of cooperation in front of the Romethia Co-op Society. The Public Authority for Roads and Transportation opened the bridge at the top of El Bedes roundabout. And the roundabout is active also, yet various other civil works need to be completed. The annual plan 2017-2018 is scheduled to continue 164 projects that will contribute more than 50 billion in revenue. And from Mashru'i Kuwaiti account, the Gulf Street Development Project is a revolving hand and the end of 2018 includes the construction of the bridge connecting the streets to cooperation. The Ministry of Works begins the Gulf Street Development Project roundabout of contraption with the aim of eliminating the crowding caused by the Beda roundabout. And from a Jarida account, Ministry of Works, the development of revolving project by creating a top bridge. For more information or details regarding Kuwait development projects, please visit the website of Ministry of Public Works. www mpw.gov.kw